This piece that Alice and I are about to play for you is called Vegan Lead by Richard Strauss. Uh, a translation is provided by Richard Stokes, which is Cradle Song. Dream, dream, my sweet, my love, of heaven that brings the flowers, blossoms shimmer there, they live from the song your mother sings. Dream, dream, bud born of my anxiety, of the day the flower unfolded, of that morning bright with blossom, when your soul opened to the world. Dream, dream, blossom of my love, of the silent, of the sacred night, when the flower of his love made this world my heaven.
our house captures a certain coziness and a feeling of safety that is an important counterbalance to the stress and fear of the pandemic. Being with family and pets, singing love songs, putting flowers in a vase, noticing the light. These are what makes a house a home. From our house to yours. Katie Headley. This is my sister, Lex Headley. Today we'll be singing, I Give My Life For You. It's from Miss Saigon, the musical. It's about a mother's love for her son. And we actually sang it when we were in high school in choir together. So it's a good pass down memory lane. Enjoy.
Rogers and Hammerstein have always held a special place in my heart for their tender love songs and campy comic relief pieces. Mr. Snow is a perfect hybrid, capturing how love has the potential to transform every peculiarity into an endearing quirk. I think it's a relevant message for many of us as we find ourselves spending more time with our deeply lovable and likely quirky families. I hope you enjoy. fund has about 900,000 in cash right now plus 200,000 in pledges due later. It's enough to get started. Our fundraising is about 300,000 short. The economy's current problems may mean we need to extend our loan and our fundraising beyond the previous timeline. A lot depends on how things go these coming months, but support so far is very encouraging. When I started to think about songs that had the theme of family, one of the first things that popped into my head was the song Brotherhood of Man from the musical How to Succeed in Business Without Really Trying by Frank Lesser. The show was about social climbing and 
cutthroat competition in a corporate setting. And the song gave it a, a feel-good, upbeat ending. What I've done is I've taken the song and called it Family of Life and turned it into a song about finding greater harmony with nature. We hope you enjoy it. Some creatures like to live in caves and sleep the winter through, while others like to stand and graze, just pausing to say moo. Amphibians like to play in showers and sing of being green, while humans spend their waking hours just staring at their screens. There is a Remember once we were but few, our branch was but a twig. No Stone Age band of humans knew our branch would grow so big. But we become so rich and fat, we're weighing down the tree. And if it ever falls down flat, goodbye humanity. Watch as the seas around us rise, the canary in the coal mine dies, as species go extinct, our world begins to shrink, we may be on the brink, why, why, but there's resiliency. which was a maudlin song about a mother's love was too embarrassing for my youngest child who then suggested and I'm quite quite flattered by the suggestion that I sing a song by one of their favorite artists Casey Musgraves and although I relate too much to this song I am very very glad to be part of a chosen family the family of the Community Church of Chapel Hill enjoy <laughs> Their 
for your worst year Don't get too mad all but your apple Don't fall too far from them They own too much wigger And drink too much liquor You wash your hands of them But blood's always thicker You might look just like them That don't mean you like them But you love them Buried and you're right back together like no time has ever gone by. Can't live with or without them. You might talk about them, but if someone else does well, then you'll knock them out. Cause when it's all said and done, they're the only ones that you got. Family is family in church or in prison. You This is a song about the cozy domesticity of old age, written by a teenager. Paul McCartney wrote this when he was 16, and the Beatles dusted it off in 1967 when they were making Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band. Everyone knows the words, so please sing along.
Thank you.